victim's credibility, but I'd be very happy to meet with her if she would like to discuss this further. Robert Neil. Will the Lord Chancellor confirm that it remains the Government's intention to update and modernise our human rights law as necessary, but doing so whilst firmly remaining uh, adherence to the Convention on, on Human Rights? Uh, yes, that's correct. Um, and I can say also that having carefully considered the Government's legislative programme in the round, uh, the ha- I can inform the House we've decided not to proceed with the Bill of Rights. But let me say that the Government remains committed to a human rights framework which is up to date and fit for purpose and works for the British people. We have taken and are taking action to address specific issues with the Human Rights Act and the European Convention, including through the Illegal Migration Bill, the Victims and Prisoners Bill, and Overseas Operations Act 2021, and indeed the Northern Ireland Legacy Bill, the last of which addressed vexatious claims against veterans and the armed forces. It is right that we recalibrate and rebalance our constitution over time. That process continues. Roberts. Rhiannon Bragg, who was held hostage by her ex-partner, has faced multiple